what's up guys and today we are going to compare between wix studio versus framer so now let's get started now let me first start with wix studio and the first thing that we will discuss is the greatest strength of wix right here which is its ease of use because wix is known for its user-friendly drag and drop interface and making it easy for beginners to create websites without coding knowledge all you have to do is to simply drag and drop any object that you want to put in inside your website and boom it would be added just like so and another strength point is its templates it offers a wide range of templates for various types of websites allowing users to customize them to their preferences and not just that wix also offers all-in-one solution because it provides hosting domain registration and a variety of built-in features such as e-commerce blogging and ceo tools and it's most suitable for small businesses and individuals and if you want a simple solution for career Creating a website quickly then Wix is the one for you all right now let's move on to Framer and when talking about Framer the advantage of Framer is that you have Academy partition where you can watch lessons in order to learn more about how to deal with Framer website so actually Framer website builder is one of the good choices if you want to learn how to make websites so you can actually use the free version and learn more about these lessons now the downside or the disadvantage in framer it is not for beginners it's primarily made for prototyping and designing so this is mostly targeted for designers and developers because framer is more geared toward designers and developers who have some coding knowledge and want more control over the design and functionality of their prototype so if you are a beginner and wants to have an an easy time making website framer is not the one for you because this have a very steep learning curve so you would need to spend some time in order to learn more about it yes you may have more control over your website but this may take longer time and may be harder so this option framer is actually for the professionals who want advanced interactions and animations like for your website so that it would be very professional and now let's get into pricing in case that you are interested in either of these platforms right here, you will need to have an idea about their pricing. So now when talking here about Framer, as you can see here, you have here the least cost plan starts at $5 per month for the mini plan. For the basic plan, you will have to pay $15 per month. Pro plan, you will have to pay $30 per month. And every one of these plans, as you can see, will give you different options and different features. And you can even here make your own code custom plan and if you want to upgrade your workspace to collaborate on all sites this will also have different plans you here have the basic plan for $20 pro plan for $40 and also the custom plan and the custom plan is actually a new option which is not found in Wix studio and now when talking about Wix studio pricing here you will have a lot of variations starting from $12 per month for the basic plan $20 per month for the standard one and for the plus you will have to pay $32 and finally elite plan will cost you $149 but this option will give you unlimited media storage 15 site collaborators 100,000 CMS items and many other features but for framer you have also the free version which you can use in order to try the website or try their features if you want and now in conclusion which one is better actually the answer of this question depends on your skills and depends on you so if you are a professional website designer or even have a background knowledge about how to deal with coding and how website and how websites are actually done framer is gonna be a good idea but if you are a beginner and you do not even know anything about the programming or anything about the website creation you can simply without hesitation choose Wix studio so so it mainly depends on your experience and knowledge so try to make your wise decision and here you have also the option of trying the free version of framer so if you do not actually know your level of experience you can simply go and try the free version which will be actually forever but it will have very very limited features and you can actually use it in order to improve your skills and website development and you can actually use it to and you can actually use it in order to improve yourself and website 
side developing and that's all for today if you find this video helpful please don't forget to support us with like subscribe comment share and see you in a new video